Mukbang, and this is hello everyone. I am April L. Nice to meet y'all. <laughs> She's so irritated. <laughs> and I won't. I'm gonna let her to describe this game because I really don't know how this is supposed to go all the way. Okay, so it's not necessarily it's really a game. A game. <laughs> it's <Super> like <laughs> it's really. So I've seen some other YouTubers do this before. It's like. Things that girls don't really admit or something like that. But we kind of spinning it to be things that girls don't really admit slash do you really do this slash have you ever slash I never. Do you know somebody that did it? Yeah. So just, you know, follow along. Yeah, y'all need it. Why can't I open these with these nails? Want me to help? Please. <laughs> can't. Do anything. Why she doing that? I could be talking my hair up. You know when you put your hair, you about to get busy. But um, what you got in your bag? Well, you know, I got my favorite addiction. Baby. No crap. I got a little shrimp with no head. Corn. Potato. I wasn't feeling this hungry tonight. Oh wait, I didn't know you got corn and potato soup. Yeah. Oh. And I got me. Some crab legs, some eggs, some potatoes. Green beans, tomatoes, potatoes. <laughs> Not the shrimp. The regular. Regular. Okay, so April, you wanna go first? Uh, let's do it. Let's do it. I'll go first. Okay, so my first do girls really admit this? Look at my boob. Look at Okay. Do girls really admit this? Or have you ever or do you know somebody that has? Right, okay. Maybe I should leave my phone open because my hand's gonna be dirty. Do girls really admit that they became more interested in a girl? I mean, <laughs> a dude just because he had more girls. So, like, a dude, you know, we know, we all know these thought men out here. <laughs> Have you ever found out, like, after you got in, you know, in a situation with somebody that he had a whole lot of girls and did they make you more interested in him? Because he had more girls. Do you answer that question first or do I answer that question first? I mean, you could go. Um, I wouldn't say, like, I'm going to answer exactly what you gave me. Um, I have not. That have not made me want somebody. Mm -hmm. I like them low-key. Not, not in the scene. What Sweetie said. I agree. That don't make me. If anything, to me, that's kind of a turn off. Like, mm -hmm. It's not that I don't want them to be in competition but i'm not Ooh, huh? like i'm not being in competition with nobody the right chef was in here the last time i went and i got hot that one hot yeah mine on this side want to taste some mine what you got mm -hmm. we got my own we want to let me taste a sausage I want good one that. um so real fat girl shit. you know like that that's not what you that's not it no nah. I, don't, I don't like that like but I do understand the thrill of it, though. I do, too. But, um, uh, if you got a whole lot of girls, have them. I'm straight. Yeah. Look, y'all. <laughs> Can we get our thumbnail, please? Hold up your crab legs. Mm. What is that? Ready? Who woke my sister, Nikki? I hate Michaela. Mm. Got one. <laughs> okay. So mine would be my first one would say. How do I word it again? How do you ask the question? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So I heard that. Well, like you said earlier, we both been fat before. <laughs> it's true. Apparently. <laughs> Are all fat girls freaky? <laughs> No, it's a lot of hormones in this food out here. 
<laughs> so, I don't know. I feel like our uh, outfit was freaky. That would be fucked. I mean, excuse me. That would be messed up to generalize in that way. But I do feel like I know a lot of freaky fat girls. Me too. <laughs> they be all on Facebook, man. They be talking nasty. They be and funny, though. Do I think that I'm more, do you think you more freaky when you were bigger? But why would that be? I don't know, it's your question, my mind. I don't know. <laughs> Go ask me. I don't know. I just, I just feel like I see it a lot. I see that goal out a lot. Mm -hmm. Like a lot of people put that like on social media. They say like bigger women are for nasty in Megan's voice. I don't know, child. You ain't gonna have a whole bunch of uh, my type of people coming for me. Come on. No. You said fat girls is freaky. What's wrong with that? <laughs> Nothing's wrong with it. Nothing's wrong with it. I don't know that. I, I feel like I'm in my same level, bigger or smaller. I just know I get no play. Oh, Lord. <laughs> but, um, um, your turn, I guess. Damn, um, okay, you slid that crab leg. Oh, my, like, uh. Let me get something to play. Okay. Okay. It's hot. Have you ever, or do girls really do this? Oh. Tell niggas to do, to block females on social media. Like, because you feel some type of way. Like, have you ever told your dude, like, you need to block her? Mm. Girls do that. And, sure. and dudes do too. Block that nigga. <laughs> they do that too. I'm not gonna lie. When I was in a relationship, that was one of my favorite phrases. <laughs> Blocker. Blocker. Now, why not? Insecure. Mm. Just like not trusting the dude I'm with and then <gasps> feeling like. Like uh, that it's it'll go further because I'm insecure about something. So yeah. Okay. The girls, it, it, it's February first, right? Mhm. Mm what time of year? Today. Uh, what's the beginning of the year? Should we get excited? We'll come to mail. Text time. Yeah. The girls when they get niggas, they uh, they text us. <laughs> It's girls when they give niggas they taxes. Is this real? I could. <coughs> I'm about to choke just thinking about it. I could never, ever give a nigga my taxes. I feel like girls probably just finesse out their taxes though. Like, let me flip it. Mm hmm. Yeah. For sure. Like, just don't trust nobody with your money. Please. Period. Don't even trust the bank. Put it in a mattress. No. Don't trust that. You better daddy my Alright. Okay. I'm next. Yep. Yeah. Okay. They showed me a little love on that. I know a lot of people are trying to real good. It's good. Mm hmm. Sound true. You like better to scrap? Mm hmm. It's not as seasoned as Juicy Crab, but. You think so? I should. You shook your bag up? No. Um, okay. We got this from um the Pirates Boy mm -hmm. in Atlanta. Oh. It's fine. Go ahead though. But um my third one is let me see. Do or have you, or do girls, mm, let me just ask it like this. Have you ever came on your cycle either like while wow, having sex with somebody? Or like you spending the night with the dude and you know, you have one of them times where that pad slipped. And you know, we know that like the night sight and the dude actually knew about it. Never. I feel like that happens though. That never happened to me. I feel like it's, it's definitely possible. I'm not saying it won't even happen to me. Right, right. But the person I am, I'm always at home. So, <laughs> and they gotta come to my house. So, 
I'm gonna be in my own home with the heavens. Mm -hmm. But unless it's like my man or something, like, and I'm spending at like, his house. But then again, I ain't gonna be tripping. I'm like, damn, my period came. I wonder how dudes act when that happens. I never experienced But that. nobody ever be challenged about that because let's grow up here. I would be so, I would feel so bad though. What if it got Especially, that's what I'm saying. Ah! Especially if it's not a dude. But I, I don't, stuff don't even get on mine because I, I feel it like in my stomach before mine even come. Like it's just like a feeling I get and I go to the bathroom and I'm like, damn, it's on the way. Yeah, but you never know stuff like that. I do mine. I feel like your body can play. I just, I just had that feeling when it's coming. Like, anyway, moving on. I don't want to talk about that. <laughs> the only thing I ever wasted to do bed was some gum. I don't burn that sheet up. And I feel so bad. <laughs> I don't burn somebody's sheets up though. <laughs> but I'm burning my own sheet, so that's why I spend a lot of money on comfort sets. <clears throat> burn them up. Um, what was it? my phone? My hands dirty. I don't want to touch my phone. Do girls, do girls really fight over guys still? In 2020. In 2020. Not like. People our age. People our age, yes. 100% sure. First of all, them baby daddies, these girls don't play about their baby daddies. <laughs> baby, they don't play no games. So yeah. They do. Mm, that's deep. Would you? Would I? If you had a you thought of your baby daddy, not your boyfriend. <laughs> <laughs> they don't play about their baby daddies. Uh I my baby daddy. I never let him go. <laughs> maybe. I don't know. Depends Sometimes on my, my anger gets the best of me. Depend on the depend on the reason. Yeah. Like, you know. This why are you right here? I didn't have my situations with girls in the past over some niggas, but it wasn't like over the niggas <coughs> to say. That is brought back up in free. <laughs> Not per she se. She fought a girl in know. college. She fought a girl in college. <laughs> what? Here it is. That's unacceptable. <laughs> I'm just saying the truth. At the end of the day, it wasn't over the dude, though. Okay? It wasn't. It was a, my respect. That's what all girls say. It was you disrespecting me. You disrespecting me. I ain't gonna say the girl disrespect me. I ain't pissed up here a lot like that. But you know, we had some little run in. Was it probably because of the nigga? Probably. For sure. But you know, whatever. It's over. That's old, baby. It was still funny. It was crazy. Don't do drugs. Right? <laughs> Don't drink with her either. Uh, I have never fallen over a guy. Ever. Like, not even like younger. Like, like an actual fist fight? No. Mm -hmm. Have I got a tool? We done exchanged a few words. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But they ain't going to no smoke. Have you ever called up a girl like to confirm yes, about your nigga? I have to. <laughs> and I'll write you. I, I, then, then, now, no. Now, I don't even have the patience. I don't have patience. Yeah. We did that in the past. I feel like, though, the times that I have, like, tried to, like, confront a girl about a new, like, it didn't go the way I thought it was going to go. They was end up being nice. You thought you were going to no, like that? No, no, no. Mm -hmm. I don't want to be nice. Because at the end of the day, I'm confronting you because I don't trust him. Mm -hmm. I'm not confronting you. Because, you know, I'm FBI agent point for 8.0. So, she I already she know. goes into her own world. I, and I always be right. Was I wrong this time? 50% yes. Ne How? How? How was I wrong? It was never confirmed. It was confirmed. He said, he said what he said. You know what he said. What did he say? He said, oh, he said it wasn't that day. She had the dates mixed up, so she was really mad at the wrong time for the wrong reason. No, I was still, it was still happening the same weekend. It, it happened after. She was already mad, but it, it really ended up happening like two or three days later. What she thought was going One on. One day later. She's smoking into existence. 
I knew it was happening. I felt it in my bones. I'm never wrong. Never wrong. Okay, I got another question. Okay. Do girls get mad at somebody they not dated if he with another girl? I feel attacked now. I feel like you just trying to. I want to know what they got to say too. Let, let me know in the comments. I want to know what everybody got to say mm -hmm. on this one. Wait, what was it? Huh? Do girls get mad at dudes they not dating? Yeah. Yes. I'm asking for that. You asked them for the girls. Yeah. The girls of the world. <laughs> for all the girls. We do. We do. You do. I do, but I really don't. I try not to. I just don't care. I come to a point where I just don't care about none of these things. <laughs> I feel it. I just want y'all to know that, um, I haven't eaten none of my food and I'm gonna keep full, but. Maybe I'm almost done. <laughs> it's so good. The thing about seafood is that I can put this down for five minutes to come back and be re energized. Like. Because it's just so light. Your turn. I asked two questions. I don't, I don't have another one. I thought she had five. Mm -mm. She lied. I only have four. Mm. That, that other one was on the fly. I feel like you could think of something. Me? Mm -hmm. I just did that one. I just did off the head. <laughs> Damn, my friend. Do girls? <laughs> these do girls really get mad about? Wait, like, did you just ask? Do they get mad if you stay on date, or do they just date? But do girls really? Okay, no, this is a good one. Do you really say one thing to a dude when you mean another thing? Yes. Don't touch me. Yeah. Leave me alone. Go yeah. for home. You really want to stay? You better not leave. You better not leave. Diesel, get on my face because you know you're not getting none of this now, child. Booty be all on the floor. Yeah, all girls do that though. But why? It's the stupidest thing in the world. Because we want you to know. They you don't. need to know. They're so dumb though. You need to know. Because sometimes I don't know what I'm sometimes you really mean it though. That's mm -hmm. the thing. That's why it's so confusing for them. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you do mean it, but I feel like it should go off the level of what what's been done. You know what I mean? Like if you drank all my water, so I got mad. That's petty. Like you could, if I say leave, you could stay. But if you did, got caught doing something or something like that, like just go. Oh yeah, they know me. Like. Yeah, you should know. Like, that's what I'm saying. You some nice size shrimp today. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The girls actually want the passcode to their man phone. I do. <laughs> I want a fake. Oh, we don't got fingerprint no more. I want a face recognition on your phone. Or would you prefer the, their phone just not to be locked? No, lock your phone. Someone might steal it. No. You need that protection from other people than me. Yeah. But most definitely, I need full access to your phone. Like, I need to know. I don't want your password. I want to see your phone. I'm like, let me see your phone. You just unlock for everything. No, I need to know. If I want to see your phone, I need to be able to get in your phone anytime I want to get in your phone. Period. Well, what would be a reason for getting into their phone? Maybe I just want to be in there. For what, though? I just need to check. Check what? Anything and everything. But I'm just confused at what you're checking. The text messages, the call log, or mm -hmm. you on that type of time, or you just wanna. You know what? It's been a very long time since I've been in a relationship, so I don't really know. I'm only speaking off the old me. Please, the old heart. Gotta go. <laughs> the old me? I need no rocks at the window. <laughs> baby, I need to know you. <laughs> I need to know. Your social security number, your passwords to everything. Like I need to know. Like I need to, I'm you. We together. We could join. We're one. I need to know everything. You're not married. Baby. That don't matter. <laughs> Relax. <laughs> you, wanna, you wanna pay a spoon bill? No. But shoot. How are you? <laughs> not motherfucking. <laughs> 
No, I'm not. But shoot, I need to know everything. I don't care. Cause I feel like that's how you get caught up. Could you move these? How do you get caught up? Like that's how you get caught up with like, oh, like he was talking to this girl for this long and you ain't know nothing about it. You couldn't hide from me. I don't want to think like that. Like, <laughs> I'm just not gonna respond. I don't want to think like that no more. Let me stop. It's it's trauma. It's traumatic. PTSD. <laughs> I'm changed. I'm a giant woman. Do girls really travel to go see niggas or girls that they talk to? Travel how far? What do you mean? Like at <laughs> travel. That means like more than 45 minutes out of mm -hmm. city limits. Yes. Mm -hmm. What if you're in a long distance relationship? Mm -hmm. Not if you no. If you if you're not in a relationship with this person. Yeah, because I don't do relationships, so yeah. <laughs> so yeah, you traveling. They have me too. Let's not get it twisted. <laughs> Drive, plane, boat, <laughs> bus, flight, no bus rider. <laughs> Y'all keep pushing. <laughs> wow. We ain't doing that type of time. <laughs> Do you? No. Her, she got local niggas. <laughs> wow. No, <laughs> I definitely didn't travel before. Who would try to say? Tell me about you. <laughs> <laughs> you know every, you know every, you literally they been on the phone with me while I was traveling a couple of times. I feel like I, no, it's like, it's, it was two people I traveled for. Mm. Yeah. Fuck for free, why not? That's true. I'm on my way. You pull up. I'm here. I'm at the airport. Come pick me up. Got to dump to the trunk. That's what I want. Um, it's so annoying, this girl. <coughs> but yeah, I've traveled. I have. Seen. It will again. I travel far for it. <laughs> <laughs> It depends though. It gotta be that we gotta be there. Like it gotta be that like Yeah, I will get flew out. Flew fly me out. Period. Energy. Period. Here. Fly me out. <laughs> That's energy. Yeah. I can't I can't be flying I can't be coming to see your stand by. I thought she might not never I might never make it. Depending <laughs> on where you live. <laughs> yeah, I agree. I definitely will full fly out for somebody. But you gotta be go fly me out. But it's gotta be there. It gotta be. It's gotta be there. Like, yeah. You know? Because I don't. Do girls really spend money on dudes? Yes. Yeah. I, I, but it's like I said, it's gotta be that energy. Like, somebody yes. gotta establish, like, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? Like, we, we in there. Because, you know, I know, bro. You know. I mean. I, I, you know, I don't mind. It's a really hard giving gifts. I'm a terrible gift giver. <laughs> I like giving gifts, though. I like you receiving gifts. I do. I like receiving gifts, but I also like giving. Like, but I, I feel like I ain't never even really had nobody where I could just like get him a gift, like go like. I, any, I feel like dudes try to play girls like they don't like they gotta use them for money and stuff, and you know yeah. what I'm saying. That's so, probably all the dudes think the girls is using them. Right, and it's like half y'all niggas homeless. Hold up, I don't gotta. I don't need you for that. I can buy myself a meal. A eh? anything that I want, I literally can get it. So it's like anything you give me, I can give myself. That's right, what that is. Right. So it's like, damn, I'm no, I don't need you. Crab leg crab. Yeah, this is, I hate these ones. Yeah, I hate them too. I just, I just let it be. But niggas always think that like if a dude buying a girl some move, you trick it off on her. Like that's just childish. This dude told me, you know that. This dude told me all this money he spent on me. We went to the movies. Oh, that dude? Yeah. That was so... Okay. No, let's talk about that. Let's talk about that. Let's talk about that. <laughs> All this money you spent on me, $12, I would cash after you there right back, sweetie. Like, come on now. He was upset. He was like, I've been playing with games. Should you play with me? For $12? Maybe. You want 15? For a movie I already seen. Who? 
Come on. The gang is. That's why I can't be nice no more. Mm -mm, me either. Don't be nice. Cause it'll get you a messed up situation. <laughs> it really will. Know your worth, lady. Stop playing with these niggas. That was good. I ain't bad at that. Ooh. God damn it! What the hell's going on? My fingers hurt. Yeah. These garlics crack beautifully too. My life. Yeah, this one. My fingers just hurt. Here we go. We're struggling right now. <laughs> this is long ass nails. Oh, see, I feel like I almost. Okay. So, more of the story is. Fuck these niggas. <laughs> we hate y'all. Hey. <laughs> no, but for real though. What's your plan for Valentine's Day before we get off? None. Here? Don't even ask me. I feel fiendy. <laughs> <laughs> Valentine's Day and Storm Rocks at uh, Couples. <laughs> Catch me. Dang. I'm not even. You know, but I played myself this year, so I ain't, I ain't worried about it. How you play yourself? Because you know, I thought I really had a Valentine. Who would you? Oh. Did you really think that was going to be Valentine's Day? Maybe. Maybe. <sighs> no. Mm -mm, I didn't see it. Mm, well. You know, your friend see it before you do. She didn't see it. She didn't tell me she didn't see it. She didn't, I also didn't, didn't like this, ma'am. But, okay. But I did, though. <laughs> <laughs> she did, but she didn't. She has something to do with it. You gotta get to know people to like them. You're the one who don't be want to give people a chance. Not me. What happened? I just gave somebody a chance. Who? Wednesday. Mm, that's a good outfit. That was messed up. I'm like, <laughs> That was messed up. That was messed up. That's gonna be a story time. We got. Yeah. I, that's gonna be a good story time. I felt for you on that one. I'm not even gonna lie. Cause yeah. I would have been heated. I wasn't even that mad. I was. I was just more so irritated. Like you fucking goofy. I would have been mad. That was your birthday. <laughs> that was her birthday. What? I wasn't even tripping though. Cause the thing is, I, I didn't even feel good. I was sick as hell. On my birthday. No. Yeah. I was taking cayenne pepper shots and shit. Like, I need to be out of nowhere. But, um, our seafood is pretty much gone. And, oh, we gotta go get dressed. We finna go pop out. Um, that's the end of the video, period. I wanna thank you all for watching this video. Comment the things that you've done before in the past or like things that you've seen with your friends, your homegirls, whatever. Comment those below in the comments and make sure you follow me on Instagram at I am Erin Monique and follow April at A P N E S B I T T. It'll be right here. And make sure you subscribe to my channel. Subscribe to my channel. Turn the notification bell on. And let's get it. It's 2020. We out here.